Going back to early 2019, and this is the media room area. This is the process of going through the entire boat, repriming it. Painted the front room way in there. Just finished painting the second coat on this room in here. And then we also did the pilot house. Here's my wife doing the pilot house. We're using Rust Script for the paint. Overall, the product has worked very well, has been extremely durable, and I just wish it was easier to purchase. We have since switched to a Pettit product, Rust Lock, because it works both out of the water and can have water exposure. getting rid of the tape along the rear. If anyone wants it, you could come purchase it from us. And here we are removing the tangs. This gave us a height increase of three or four inches in the ceiling area. Basically, we are just roughing everything up before doing the painting. And you can see we're also using a breathing system. Highly recommend that. Here's the nicely clean, de-rusted salon area. We're up here to clean it, acetate it most of it, and then we're going to spray it again with SR-17. And Jeannie's been down here in the what's going to become the future utility area. She's been cleaning, acetating it, and then we'll SR-17 it again. And tomorrow we're going to in the morning spray it with chloride, and then maybe in the afternoon or early morning we'll finally get this flooring painted and then it'll just be be ready to start work on the walls and ceiling and then that will pretty much get all the upper area painted and rust proof again or rust protected at least we start the uh, painting of the salon I really like watching this in the high speed it's quite interesting watching how much quicker it goes by. You know, I actually really like paint days because we'd get a couple hours between each day. And here we remove the diesel heater and the hot water heater and all of the hoses and the hot water heater went right there. And there's the heater and there's the gigantic mess that got made. And plan to call it quits for the day, clean up. Tomorrow I'll start clean up with all this and then hopefully get in here in the next day or so and paint it all. This will be all nice, nice looking. Well, nice as it can be. Bye. So down here in the Equipment room, uh, engine room, storage room. Started running uh, at least rough in some. We got the central vacuum line going there. Got the plumbing line going there. We uh, tore out, well, didn't tear it out, but removed the floor so we can do the run. I've also cut some holes for the piping there. And there's one over there that you can't quite see on the video. And the last couple things, we uh, painted that side, or Jeannie painted that side of the flooring. Uh, we also used some epoxy to fill some voids. And we removed the water maker that had been above the waste tank and the uh, down there. So the next thing is going to be remove the waste tank and then uh, get that area painted and get the area by my feet painted later. Oh.